It's freestyle time. Let's go. Welcome back, Monster Jam fans of Science Series 11. And yep, you heard it right. It's freestyle time. So, that's the track. So, if you weren't with us last time, it was Son of a Digger taking racing and Northern Nightmare taking uh, mini racing. Now, let's see who can win freestyle. So, first off, it's our racing champion, Son of a Digger. And it is a six for Son of a Digger. So here we go. We're going to start off with the middle jump. The red can with the purple ramp. These are all just leftover cans that I randomly put together. So here we go. Oh! Kind of did a front flip going off to the side. Not a bad start. Now for hit number two. The one with the small cans. That one is the double van stack. And here we go. And he misses both of the vans. Alright. Now hit number three. Going for the Gears Rocket. Haven't done this one in a while. Here we go. Oh! Falls off the ramp on the way down. Yeah. Well, now he's doing a handstand. Or a moonwalk, whatever. Hit number four. Going for the triple stack. Oh! All right, not bad for the first truck out. Already, somebody has destroyed one of the bosses. And hit number five, going for the monster energy jump. Oh! All right, we're already seeing a little bit of destruction here. And his final hit, going for the middle jump once again. Oh! Nice jump by Son of a Digger. And that is your truck to beat. Alright, next up, your mini racing champion, Northern Nightmare Zombie. How many times will Northern Nightmare get to go? And again. And it is a six for Northern Nightmare. Alright, we're going to start off with the double van stack. See if we can clear Son of a Digger. And he goes off to the side. Hmm, maybe I should have put something there. Hit number two, going for the middle jump. Let's see if we can destroy that giant can. Oh! Unbelievable air by Northern Nightmare. Number three, he's going for the monster energy jump. Oh! Does a sky wheelie, lands on one of the monster energy cans, and keeps it on all four. Now he's going for the Gears Rocket. Let's see if he can do better than Son of a Digger did. Alright, that was much better. Not really that good of a jump, but, you know. Number five, he's going for the Triple. Oh! Alright. Completely clears a triple stack, colliding with the wall protection, knocking it over. Alright, that was good. But he's got one more hit to go. Can he beat Son of a Digger? Well, we're about to find out in 3, 2, 1. Oh! Huge air for Northern Nightmare. Lands on all four and keeps going. He even leaves a mark showing where he landed. And we have a new leader. This is going to be tough, guys. Is, so Northern Nightmare is your new leader. And up next on our list is the Mercedes-Benz Unimog. New, the newcomer to the Slam series, and he will get five attempts. So here we go. We're gonna start off with the Gears Rocket. Oh, maybe I made that a little too steep, but good hit. All right, now for hit number two, going for the Monster Energy Jump. Oh. Nice rollover. Tries to take out the mega can while oh, he's at it. Going for the middle jump. Oh! Oh, that was kind of a realistic crash there. The way he went up in the air, bounced, and then rolled. 
Okay, number uh, four. Yeah. I almost forgot for a second. Going for the double van stack. Oh, and he hits the mega can. These ramps are actually turning out pretty okay. And he collides with the wall. And now for my favorite obstacle. I always save this one for last because of that reason. Or, though I didn't save it for last for this one, so. Anyways, the triple. Holy crap. Wow, I think I did a good job on this triple. But the Mercedes Benz will not get the win, unfortunately. Fear the curse. It's Captain's Curse. Let's see what this guy can do. Roll that dice, and it is going to be a four for the captain. All right, we're going to start off with the vans. Oh, loses control on the way down, flips it over. What a hard hit. In real life, he would have been done. All right, number two, he's going for the middle jump. Oh, Captain's Curse is kind of out of control. Must have some kind of steering issue. But, he's trying to power through it. Now he's going for the Monster Energy Jump. Let's we'll see if he can get his crap together. And he does. Oh, nice save. Okay, final, final attempt. Going for the triple sack. In three, two, whatever. Oh, man, they're all clearing it. I think I made this too good. See, here's what I did. And now, whew, we kind of got a tie going on here. Er, eh, I don't know. You know what? I'm going to leave them both there. And up next, it is time for El Toro Loco, the orange one. And it will be a four for El Toro. So for his first hit, he's going to go for the Gears Rocket. Oh, oh, wow. I might need to fix the ramp a little bit. But that was pretty cool. Number two is going for the double van. And finally, somebody hit it the correct way. <laughs> All right. <laughs> North versus South. I swear I'm going to do it one day. Either that or Marvel versus DC. Uh, stay tuned for that decision making. But for now, Monster Energy Jump. And now it's more like a backflip now. Number three. Going for the middle jump. Oh, man, this thing really likes landing on its roof. First a form of momentum backflip, then a front flip. What's next? All right, last up, you know what he's going for. And you know, he's covered in dirt. Here we go. Oh, all right. Man, he, he must be as tired as I am almost every day. Just wants to lay down. All right, next up. It's Soldier Fortune. The Gears won because the Hunter one mysteriously disappeared. Like everything I touch. And it will be a 5 for Soldier Fortune. Alright, you know we're going to start off with the triple. Oh! He goes off the track. Alright. Hit number 2. Going for the Gears Rocket. And he just blasts right through it. I, I, I gotta fix that thing. Monster energy jump. Oh. Nice, nice. <sighs> Alright. Now for his next hit. Let's see, uh, going for the middle. Oh, oh, there goes the car. And now for his final hit, going for the van sack. Here we go. And, oh. No, no, we do not have a new leader. Soldier Forging Gear will not get the win. Come here. All right, next up, representing the zombie team, it's Monster Mutt Dalmatian Zombie. 
It is a six. Okay. Well, I need to fix this real quick. Okay, I think I fixed it. Now let's test it out. For hit number one. All right, that that one didn't count. I just want to test this. There we go. All right, the first one didn't count. Honestly, I don't even know why I redid that. <laughs> Anyways, hit number two. Going for the monster energy jump. Man, she does not want to stay on the track. Number three, going for the triple. Stay on the hot list track. Yeah! Oh, beautiful. Number four, going for the double van stack. Oh. All right, now for hit number five, going for the middle jump. Here we go. Oh, what the heck was that? That was weird. All right, final hit, going for the triple stack one more time. Oh, right up against the wall. Knocking it, knocking it over again, or n moving it. And, yeah, oh, crap, can't discourage. Oh, oh shoot. Uh-oh. All right. Looks like Northern Nightmare is, is the leader now. Because I don't remember what, where they were before the wall got moved. So, want to welcome the newest addition to the team. Or to this Science Series, whatever. Uh, CN3030 Productions. Behind the wheel of Hot Wheels Taxi. He didn't make it for racing, but he made it just in time for freestyle. In my newest Hot Wheels monster truck. See what he can do here. He will get five chances to prove himself. And it's getting windy out here. The leaves are falling. It looks more like fall out here now. And I love it. Alright, first off. Going for the gears rocket. Oh! Whoa! Well, imagine taking a ride in this taxi. Alright, now for hit number two. Going for the monster energy jump since he hit that on his way. He down. And he misses the monster energy jump. Well, at least the can's there. Whatever. Hit number three. Going for the middle. Oh! What air! Unbelievable. Okay, number four, going for the double vans. Oh, and he di he damaged one of the vans, finally. These are just small soda cans, in case you're wondering what the heck they are. And one more hit for the taxi, going for the triple. Man, those wheels are cool. Uh, oh, ow, oh, crap. Slid across the concrete. Going out of bounds. And the body's okay. A well, well, little chip there, but that's okay. Went out of bounds. He was just too good. I don't know why I... There we go. Alright, next up, another zombie truck. Megalodon Zombie. And, wow, everyone's getting sixes. Uh-oh. Anyways, going for the triple first. Because, why not? I do what I want. Oh! Man, everyone is going for that wall. They do not like it. I did end up making this a little short. I guess you could say it's kind of a challenge. Or even like a small arena, whatever. Hmm, maybe I should do an arena tour. Hmm. Alright, at number two, going for the Gears Rocket. Oh, oh, nice save. Hit number three, going for the middle. Oh, what a wreck. Now for his next hit, uh, four? Yeah. Oh, hang on. Uh, uh, five, sorry. Oh, all right. Megalodon. Yeah. All right, final hit. He's going to go for the middle jump one more time. See if he can do better. Nope, he did worse. Okay, next truck up is my favorite El Toro Loco. And, oh, it's going to be a two. That's a first. All right. 
Do we go for the middle jump first? And nobody wants to go down it properly because everyone's stupid. Well, let's see if we can do better on the triple for his final hit. Oh! Goes off the track, right? Oh, yeah. So, El Toro Loco will not get the win. Okay, it's been a day now. I had to stop in the middle of it because I had other things to do, but back to the action. It's really windy out, nice and cool. Perfect for me. So, let's do this. Up next, it is Thanos. Well, and it is a one for Thanos. Let's see if he can snap away the competition here. That made no sense, did it? Whoa! What air! What air by the Mad Titan. Takes out a yellow car. Lands right behind Northern Nightmare. Alright. Not bad for his first science series. That was pretty good. Okay, who's next? Up next, another zombie truck. This is Dragon Zombie. This one's going to be a Halloween edition science series. But, uh, I got busy. And it is a six for the dragon. Alright, we're going to start off with the double van stack. And here we go. Oh, alright, not bad, not bad. Would have loved for him to land on one of the vans, but whatever. Okay, hit number two. Going for the triple. Wasn't really planning on it, but I just put it there without thinking. Oh, whoa. Well, that was, that was kind of cool. Not really sure what happened on the way down, but that was, that was a pretty cool jump, though. Despite I'm not making it all the way. And there are some leaves on the track, so we're going to crush those. As he goes for the gears rocket for his third hit. Oh, seems to have a steering issue also on Dragon. Alright, number four, he's going for uh, the monster energy jump. Alright. And number five, he's going for the middle jump. Oh! And for his final hit, see if he can clear the triple stack. Here we go. Oh! That was way better, but unfortunately, he will not get the win over Northern Nightmare Zombie. Alright. And up next, it is time for Max D. And he will get two attempts. So, we're going to go for the triple first. There we go. Oh! Goes off the track. He kind of went a little too crazy. Well, it's Max D. What do you expect? All right, now for his final hit. Going for the middle jump. See if he can crush that Mega Can. Oh! Oh! What a leap. What a landing. But... Northern Nightmare is still your leader. Need to fix that. Ground's a little uneven. But, Northern Nightmare is still your leader. Maxie, not. Alright, next up, it is my custom Gravedigger 10. I'm not really one for doing customs, but I am proud of how well this turned out. You can use a Showtime chassis, or roll cage, to, just to add extra detail. This should be a Retro Rebel next year, along with... The improved team mess. Did you guys see that, by the way? It's in the Dirty to Clean series with Bulldozer. Uh, that's really cool. Can't wait to get that. They can do that one, the 2001 El Toro Loco, and possibly this. I'll have to talk to Monster Jam OCD about it. Anyways, getting off topic here. Or I apologize. And it is going to be a four for the Grave Digger. Alright, we're going to start off with the double van stack. Oh, oh, lose control on the way down, flips it over. Alrighty. Going for the monster energy jump. Oh, oh. And number three, going for the middle jump. Send it. And he did. That was awesome. That was some serious elevation, Holmes. And now for his final hit, he's going to go for the triple. See if he can clear it the way he cleared everything else in the middle. Oh! Oh my, he went over the wall. Well, luckily, nobody was hurt. Everyone's okay. 
Gravedigger just blacksmiths it. Or Captain's Cursed it. Whatever you prefer. You guys know what I'm talking about. Pro probably blacksmiths because he didn't go into the stands. Gravedigger just went next to it. Anyways, that was, that was too good. I, I knew that was going to happen. I made this too small. Whoops. Alright, next up, it is Soldier Fortune Black Ops, which, by the way, happy Veterans Day. I recorded this on November 11th. Not sure when this will be uploaded. As soon as possible. Probably tomorrow, which would be November 12th. Eh, we'll see. But thank you to all those who served. It is a four. Alright, let's go. I'm gonna go for the double van stack first. Oh! He hits the side of the bus, flips over. Somebody else needs to crush that. There's like a small dent in it. Alright, hit number two. Going for the middle, why not? Oh! Big air and back in the same spot he was on his first hit. He must like that area. Alright, going for the monster energy jump. Excellent. Nice save by Black Ops. And now for a final hit. You know what he's hitting. Come on. You guys have watched me long enough. And for those that are just now getting to know me, well, here you go. Well, oh, completely clearing the triple. I did too good a job on this. So he bounces off the wall. And Northern Nightmare is still your leader. Get ready to feel the power. It is Blue Thunder Zombie. Probably the most weirdest zombie truck that they did. Though, uh, I don't hate it. I, I think it's cool. I like Blue Thunder. Uh, uh, let's try it again. Got a caught there. And it is a three. Alright, for the first time we get a three. Alright, we're going to go for the middle jump first. Wow! Wow! That was a little weird. Not to sound like B-movie. He, he slipped. He hit the, hit the side and just... Woo -woo. That, that, that was just weird. One of these days I'm going to have to figure out how to do slow-mo replays. Anyways, double fan stack time. Oh! He hits the mega can. Flips it over and lands it back on all four. Okay. One more hit to go for Blue Thunder. And he goes for the triple. Can he beat Northern Nightmare? Uh, oh! Uh-oh. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new leader. He's touching the wall. Northern Nightmare's not. We have a new leader, Blue Thunder Zombie. And up next... The awesome looking Gravedigger Spectra. It was this black roll cage that kind of reminds me of the time when Dennis Anderson used Adam's chassis. It was just the Gravedigger body on the Gravedigger the Legend chassis. Yeah, look it up. Anyways. And is a two for the Gravedigger. Alright, we're going to go for the middle first. Oh! Alright. Not bad. All right, one more hit to go. He's going for the triple. Can he beat Blue Thunder? Oh, hang on, I need to fix the tire. All right, I think I got it. Here we go. Oh! Does half a backflip, bounces off the roof. He gets close to the wall, but he's not touching it like Blue Thunder, so Grave Digger, not getting the win. Though we got a couple more Digger trucks to go. Well, let's go. Okay, next up. It is Monster Mutt Zombie. He came so close to winning racing, but he see if he can redeem himself in freestyle as he has two attempts. This time we're going to start off with the triple stack just to change it up a bit. And here we go. Oh! And he's over the wall of protection too. Oh man. And all these leaves everywhere. But once again, everybody's okay. Alright. Now for his last hit. Going for the middle jump. Can he beat Blue Thunder? Well, oh, kind of does a front flip in the air, hits the ground hard, and lands on all four. But 
Blue Thunder is still your leader. Okay, next up, it is the Land Rover. This thing is pretty cool, and there's a freaking paint chip there. How'd that happen? And it's three for the Land Rover. Okay, gonna go for the double stack first. Whoa! Keys to setting, and on 04, that was a perfect jump. All right. Hit number two, going for the triple stack. Here we go. Oh, and off the track he goes. Oof. All right, one more hit. He's going to go for the middle. See what he can do here. Oh, and he sticks the landing. Landing on all four, but Blue Thunder Zombie, still your leader. Good performance by the Land Rover, though. Okay, next up. The 2020 All-Star Challenge Hot Wheels Racing Champion, Max D. Hunter. Forgot the dice. And see if Max D. can get another win. And it is a 5 for Max D. Let's go. Gonna start off with the Gears Rocket. Oh, did he, did he do a backflip on that? Looked like it. I don't know, I was too quick to see. Okay. And number two, going for the monster energy ramp. Alrighty. Not bad. Okay, next up, going for the double van stack. Let's see if he can destroy one of those vans. And he doesn't. Nice front flip, though. Alright. Alright, next hit. Hit number four, he's going for the middle jump. And he loses control and does a cartwheel. But he's got one more hit to go. You know what it is. And here we go. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, wow. Oh. Alright, um. Hmm. Well, this is kind of debatable. Actually, no, not, not really. It has to be the tires touching the wall. So, Blue Thunder is. Max D wasn't. Alright. Uh, let me know if I should change that rule. I'm kind of thinking about it a little. Anyways, until then, next up is Gravedigger Zombie. This thing would have looked cool in real life. Oh, and it is a one. Alright, going for the middle jump. And here we go. Oh, tough break for Gravedigger Zombie. What a crash. And up next, looking to destroy the competition, the Destroyer. Hope to see that truck return one day. And it is a six. Hope to see the truck return one day, either driven by Roger Steidel again or even under a new owner. Well, we'll see. Only time will tell. Until then... Going for the triple stack for his first hit. Oh, lands right on the roof. That looked like it hurt. But the truck's fine. It appears the axles are okay. So let's continue. Hit number two, he's going for the double van stack. Whoa. Oh. Ooh. Man, that was that was fast. I got a good feeling about the destroyer. And number three, he's going for the Gears Rocket. Oh, loses control going down. Running right into it on its roof. All right, he's got more chances. Hit number four, he's going for the Monster Energy Jump. Oh, go home, Destroyer, you're drunk. All right, those weren't his best hits, but let's see what he can do for the middle jump. Oh, what a hard hit by the Destroyer. Now he's got one more hit to go. See what he can do. All right, one more hit to go. And he's going for the triple one more time. See what he can do here. Let's go. Oh, nice jump, but the Destroyer will not get the win. Sad. I got a couple more Destroyers coming. You'll see them. All right, next up is Bakugan Dragonoid, the wind one. It looks like I got an error one. Noticed this a couple days ago. 
see the difference on the on this tire and this tire? Yeah, yeah, that one's backwards. Look at that. That's cool. I got an error one. That's that's cool. And it is a five for the Dragonoid. Okay. I fixed the ramps on this side, wet them down, flattened them out. Let's test them out, shall we? We go for the monster energy jump. Oh! Huh, nailed it. Now, the jump and the ramp. Alright, let's test the, the gears rocket. I'll save the triple stack for last. Oh! Alright, that was much better. I made it more steep. And uh, it looked like it worked. <clears throat> All right, number two. I didn't do anything with the van stack ramp because it seems like it's okay. So here he goes. Oh, yep, yep, definitely doesn't need fixing. All right. And of course, there's not really much I can do with the middle jump, so we'll just leave it how it is. And here he goes for his fourth hit. Oh. All right, Dragonoid. He's really doing a good job out there. But let's see what he can do for his final hit. And here we go, with his backwards wind tire. Holy crap, that was good. Man, that dragon really flew, but he bounces off the wall, not touching it at all. So Blue Thunder Zombie is still your leader. And remember, if Blue Thunder wins this, he will get a chance to go to the Science Series All-Star Challenge 3. Whenever that may be, probably in early December. I don't know. Thinking about doing one more science series after this one before I do it. <laughs> Anywho, next up is Digger's Dungeon. And it's gonna be a three for the dungeon. Someday I'll go there. Someday. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Uh, the double van stack. Oh, nice hit. I probably should have put that van a little closer to the other one. Alright, hit number two. Going for the middle jump. Oh! Loses control going down. Collides with the monster energy can. Alright, one more hit to go for Digger's Dungeon. And you know what it is. Don't go over the wall protection. And he goes around it. Nice loophole. Yeah, forgot to put that there. I just moved it in case somebody needed to come through here. Anyways. Yeah. And next up, it is Maximum Destruction. See how many times he gets to go? And it's a six for Max Destruction. Alright, we're going to go for the Gears Rocket first, because why not? Oh. Oh, that sucked. Going for the monster energy ramp. Perfect jump, perfect landing. Uh oh, why couldn't you? Why can't you say that for your last set? Huh? Hmm. Hmm. All right, going for the middle jump. Oh, bummer. All right, next hit. Going for the double van stack. Oh, tries to save it, but just couldn't get it. Looks like they shot him off. Stupid R.I.I. Always being used at the wrong time. And now for the fifth hit, the triple. And here we go. Oh, come on. Now for his final hit. He's going to go for the triple one more time. Oh, fix the tire. And here we go. Alright, that was better. It, you know, if only he had stayed on the track instead of going out of bounds around the wall. <sighs> oh well. Blue Thunder is still your leader. Okay, up next is my all-time favorite gravedigger. The Green Ghost Gravedigger. Gosh, if they, if they brought this design back, I would sell my freaking soul to see it. And it is a 5 for the Gravedigger. All right, going for the monster energy jump first. Looks like one of the trucks messed up the can, so this will be interesting. And that was, that was pretty good. Finally, somebody else crushed the cans. That was awesome. Okay, hit number two, going for the double. Oh, 
and then he misses everything. I should have put a McDonald's logo on this and called it the McDouble. Eh. And now for the fifth hit, the triple. And here we go. Oh, come on. Now for his final hit. He's going to go for the triple one more time. Oh, fix the tire. And here we go. All right, that was better. It, you know, if only he had stayed on the track instead of going out of bounds around the wall. <sighs> oh, well. Blue Thunder is still your leader. Okay, up next is my all-time favorite gravedigger, the Green Ghost Gravedigger. Gosh, if they, if they brought this design back, I would sell my freaking soul to see it. And it is a five for the Grave Digger. All right, going for the Monster Energy Jump first. Looks like one of the trucks messed up the can, so this will be interesting. And that was, that was pretty good. Finally, somebody else crushed the cans. That was awesome. Okay, hit number two. Going for the double. Oh. And he misses everything. I should have put a McDonald's logo on this and call it the McDouble. Eh. Alright, number uh, three. Yeah, I almost forgot how many I did for a second. Number three, going for the middle. Oh! What are those all these trucks and attacking the wall? They do not like that wall. Alright, hit number four, going for the triple. Oh, ouch. That's gonna hurt. Alright. One more hit to go. He's gonna go for the middle one more time. Here we go. Oh! Nice jump by Grave Digger. But he will not get the win over Blue Thunder Zombie. And speaking of zombies, here comes the Red Zombie. I cannot wait to get the biker one. And it's gonna be a five for the Red Zombie. Alright, we gotta stop. We are going to start off with the double sack. Alright, not bad. That was the first. Alright, number two, going for the middle jump. Oh, whoa. Okay, that was crazy. Number three, going for the monster energy jump. Oh, so hitting the mega can. Though he didn't do any damage to it. Alright. He's got two more hits to go. Let's see what he can do. As he goes for the Gears Rocket. And if you're wondering where I got that name, you can thank HobbyBuddy99 for that. Oh, oh, that was awesome. Left a good sized dent in the Monster Energy can and lands it on all four. One more hit to go. He's going for the triple. Can he make it? Oh! Clears the triple. Crashes into the wall. Hit it real hard. But Blue Thunder Zombie is still your leader. Can anybody beat him? Well, we got quite a few trucks left to go here. So, there are more than one chances here. Alright, next up. It's time for Excalibur. Or Excalibur, I said that wrong. And it is a five for Excalibur. So, what do we hit first? Uh, the middle jump. Yes. And here we go. Oh! Huge air for Excalibur. Now he's going for the monster energy jump. Oh, I got a good feeling about Excalibur here. Oh, I said that about, uh, who was it? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, Destroyer. Number three, going for the triple. Oh! Yeah. Scalibur is just going crazy. He is determined to win this. Now for his fourth hit, he's going for the double. Oh. All right. And hit number five, he's going for the middle one more time. Can he beat Blue Thunder? No, he will not. Excalibur will not get the win. And now look out, he's vengeance. He is the knight. It's Batman. See what the Batman can do here. I look forward to seeing that movie. I might go see it at the theater, who knows. 
And it is a three for the Batman. Okay, we're gonna go for the double van stack first. Oh, and he runs into Excalibur. Yeah, I forgot to move Excalibur, but you know what? I'm leaving him there. It's another obstacle. All right, going for the triple for his second hit. Oh, what the heck? All right, one more hit to go for the Batman. And you know what? I'm going for the triple one more time. And he goes off the track again. I guess Gotham needs him because he's trying to escape the track and go elsewhere. But Batman will not get the win. Sucks. Okay, next up, it is El Toro Loco, the red one. <laughs> really love that they did that. And it'll be a five for the red El Toro Loco. And it's like they went back in time. <clears throat> Anyways, first off, going for the Gears Rocket. And he falls off the track, crashing into the other obstacle. And over on the side he goes. All right, number two, going for the monster energy ramp. Oh, El Toro's having some serious issues out there. But hopefully he can power through and keep on going. That's part of life. And hit number three, he's going for the double stack. There he goes. Oh. All right, not bad. That was way better than the last time. And now for hit number four, he's going for the middle. Oh, huge jump, lands on the monster cans and tries to go for the triple stack, which will be his final hit. And here we go. Oh, Just running right into the wall. And uh, yeah. Okay, El Toro Loco will not get the win. Came close, though. Ooh, it's starting to get windy again. Feels nice. Next up is Gravedigger the Legend. And it's a one for the Legend. All right, triple. Oh, right into the wall. And he is touching the wall, but Blue Thunder's other tire is closer, so... He still has the lead over the legend. Can anybody beat Blue Thunder? We're getting low on trucks here. And now it is time for Double Decker. See what he can do here. And it is a two for Double Decker. I'm gonna go for the middle jump first. And here we go. Oh! Finally, somebody crushed that van again. All right, that was awesome. Now he's got one more head to go. He's gonna go for the triple. And here we go. Oh! And Double Decker will not get the win. All right, next up it's the Bro Camino, the Breaking World Records edition. Let's see what he's gonna do here. Oh, and it's a six for Bro Camino. All right. So he's gonna go for the triple first. He's starting off big. And excellent jump by Bro Camino. Completely clearing the triple and colliding with the wall. They do not like that wall, do they? Man, that Gears Rock is completely destroyed now. I'm going to leave it like that. See, see what happens. As he goes for it for a second hit. Oh, and he does a front flip off of it and lands on all four. All right, number three. The, the middle. I almost said triple. Oh! Ouch. And number four. Going for the double stack. Oh! Hits the mega can. Takes out a car. Sounds like there's a plane going over. I'm sorry if you can hear it. Number five. Going for the middle once again. And here he goes. Oh, he does not want to go down it, does he? And for his final hit, he's going for the triple one more time. And here he goes. Oh! And Bro Camino will not get the win. So close, though. Or kind of, sort of, I don't know. 
All right, next up, the Vampire Great Clips Mohawk Warrior. And it's going to be a five for Mohawk Warrior. That Monster Energy can is somehow got knocked out even more. But we're going to leave it like that and see what happens. So he's going to go for that for his first hit. Here we go. Oh, nice. There goes the other car. <laughs> All right. That bus is getting more exposed. Let's see if somebody can destroy it here. They got. It's going to be easier for them now. Which is why he's going for the middle for a second hit. Here we go. Oh, he clears it and takes out a car with him. Well, that car was already moved. Now it's completely off the ramp. And now it's just a freestanding crush car. And look who's come to join us. Say hi to everyone. Yep, this was your mini racing champion. The one who was in Northern Nightmare. And that was Doctor Strange the Cat. Anyways, hit number three. He's going for the double. Oh, and he hits the Mega Can and keeps it going until he runs into the red van. All right, number four, I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Going for the middle one more time. Oh, right on Excalibur. And now for his final hit, he's going for the triple. Let's see what he can do here. For his final hit. Oh! And another one goes over the wall. And you know what? I'm leaving him there. That was his final hit. He didn't hurt anybody. So he's just, he's just going to chill there. Alright, next up is Pirate's Curse Ghost. This thing is awesome, I tell you. And, oh, it's going to be a one. Alright, triple. Oh, whoa! That was a very realistic crash that he just did there. That was awesome. But, sadly, he won't get the win over Blue Thunder. Blue Thunder is still your leader. All right. Okay, next up, it is the Retro Snake Bite. If you grew up in the 90s, then I bet you're feeling nostalgic right now. And it's going to be a five for the snake. Okay, going to go for the Monster Energy Jump first. Oh, nice wheelie by Snakebite. Too bad this isn't the two-wheel skills. Number two, going for the double. Here we go. Oh, and he's on the back tires again. Who knew a snake could stand up like that? And number three, uh, going for the middle jump. Oh, nice Nice jump by Snakebite. Hit number four. Uh, going for the Gears Rocket. Sn oh. Man, Snakebite. You, you, I don't even know what to say about him. All I know is he's been struggling to get a win this entire year. Now he's on to his final hit. See, he's, he's really eager to get down there. Can he win this? As he goes for the triple. No, he will not. As he goes out of bounds, Snakebite will not get the win. Maybe I'll invite him to the All-Star Challenge. Then he can really prove himself there. Despite him not getting a single freaking win this entire year. Alright, we are now down to three trucks, and this is one of them. The Trick Flow Bigfoot. Oh, I just really yeeted that dice. Let me try that again. And it is a six for Bigfoot. All right, we are going to go for the middle first this time. Are you guys silly? I'm still going to send it. Oh, lands on the van. Somersaults all the way to the to the wall. What a hit. Okay, hit number two. Going for the van sack since he hit that despite him hitting the middle jump. Here we go. Oh, nice hit. And just like Snakebite, lands it on the back tires. Alright, number three is going for the Monster Energy Jump. Oh. And number four, going for the Triple. Ah, oh, why do they all go there? Number five, going for the middle one more time. Oh, 
Oh, right on the car. Right on the roof. Is the truck okay? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Oh, well, a little chip on the edge there, but... I, you won't notice. Just don't look too hard. All right, one more hit. Going for the triple. Can he beat Blue Thunder? Nope. He really likes being over there. That's why I got this mat here. All right, we are down to just two trucks now. And one of them is this guy right here. Max D. Where's the dice? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Keep forgetting to grab it because I'm an idiot. All right, here we go. Max D. Tent. And is a four for Max Destruction. No, no, no it's still a four. Don't try to change it. Where, uh, yeah. There we go. All right, there we go. Mo going for the Monster Energy Ramp first. Sorry, about the background noise. And uh, nice jump. Got a little distracted there. Number two, going for the middle jump. Oh, what even was that? And hit number three, going for the triple. Oh, sweet. And now for his last hit, going for the double. Doing something a little different here. See what we can do. Oh, runs right into Excalibur and stops dead in his tracks. All right, Max D will not get the win. All right, last but not least, it's time for the Grave Digger. This one has been trying to get a win since 2017. Let's see if we can make it happen today. And it is going to be a six for Grave Digger. All right, we're going to start off with the Gears Rocket. Oh. Number two, going for the double. All right. Okay, now for number three. And what's number three? Um, the Monster Energy Jump. Why not? The can is completely messed up now, so this will, this will be good. All right, tries to do a front flip, but I uh, just was going too fast for it. Okay, hit number four, going for the triple. And here we go. Oh, oh, and there he goes over the wall. What's with them going over the wall, man? Number five, he's going for the middle. Oh, and somebody crushed the red van. That was a weird landing, but at least somebody destroyed that van. Kinda. And now for his last hit. This is it. Who will be the freestyle champion? Will it be Blue Thunder Zombie? Or will it be Gravedigger? Gravedigger lost in the mini racing. Alright, we're about to find out who's the winner. Oh, hold on, I got... It's gotta be perfect. Alright, here we go. Final hit in 3, 2, 1. Oh, no. And he is not touching the wall. Therefore, your winner is Blue Thunder. All right. Congratulations to Big Bank Bossman 223S. You have been invited to the Science Series All-Star Challenge. Though I'm not sure when that will be. I might do one more Science Series before then. And hopefully it won't take me three weeks to do it. But we'll see. So here is your encore. Go crazy. Yep, go crazy indeed. And triple. And now all of a sudden he doesn't want to go on any of them. Let's try that again. All right. And here's a little extra in honor of Veterans Day. Here goes Soldier Fortune. Whoa. And Soldier Fortune Black Ops. All right. All right, now for our three champions to go. They're all going to go for the triple. Here we go. And Northern Nightmare fell, but he's okay. Oh, he's over the wall. And Blue Thunder. And there goes that wall. They're destroying the arena now. All right, now for all three to go on the middle. Here we go. 
Oh, son of a tiger getting the biggest air. All right. All right, one at a time now. Oh. All right, Northern Nightmare block of the way, so Blue Sox is going to go for the vans. All right. All right, congratulations to our champions, Monster Jam Dallas, Big Bang Boss Man, and Dr. Strange the Cat. Thank you for participating in this sign-up series. Hope you all enjoyed. Like and subscribe, and don't go anywhere. Don't leave my channel yet, because i got a lot more to go. See you in the next sign-up series. Until then, this is Joseph Nelson signing off. Okay, thanks for watching, Joseph. Hope you enjoyed it.